Hello, it's me, Paddy. Howdy, Paddy, I'm back again. Right. <laughs> First of all, I'm going to say to you, uh, Johnny, right? Please, Johnny, right? Don't be like your cousin, Martin, right? Because don't let, leave yourself that low, right? Because if you do, you're going to be worse than him, right? See, what happened with this uh, Martin Yeovil, right? He's very, very sneaky, and for that reason, this is why I'm not letting Michael James, or Michael James himself, is not fighting him, right? Does that mean I don't want him fighting, Michael James won't fight him, right? For, the, for, that, for this reason, right? When Michael James was fighting Bulls is John, Bulls is John is John, everything was set, he agreed. Good, lovely. Martin comes behind John, him and John sorted it out. You step aside and I'll fight Michael James instead of you, John, right? Now, you went there and then, right? And Michael James would have accepted your fight, but you're doing it a sneaky way that you went behind, behind, behind our backs, behind everyone's back, and rang out as a paddy, Lee Carson, right? Saying, we don't know ye, and we don't know fight off ye, and one thing or another. Now, John, listen to this, our man Martin, right? Martin, if you just take a look and just check what, what you're doing, right? No, what's his name? That's Johnny. But Johnny, don't have a bit of understanding, Johnny. Have a bit of dignity, right? And a bit of understanding, Johnny. Don't be as cowardly as that man, right? Because you were sent for the day of Sammy's John Joe. He made the tape this morning. You said to Sammy's John Joe, John Joe, you make the tape. If, if we're accepted, if you challenge us, we will accept. Right, fair enough. I, pre I respect that you did do it. No, you did. No, what does it mean? You went down there a while ago and you turned around you want to fight James Skewey. Oh, come on, right? After some, after 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 our James's, James's, Huey sitting for some of John Paul. You, Johnny, had a chat with some of John Paul. Can I fight in the stone? No, yo, you want to fight the boys. Um, so what, what are you doing this for, lads? I, I know what you do. You're better off then getting on the tape and saying you're not fighting those men. And boys, you know some. We will look at it and say to ourselves, right. Fair play to you, lads. You're not, you're not able or... Fair play, you look at you, you just don't want to fight. And then we, we, we don't understand that. You can't make a man go fight. Them, right, boys? Mm -hmm. So what we need to do then, right, is this. Now, the fight is on. The fight is on. You, you know who you're fighting. It's on for our 11 or 12 weeks, I think it is, whatever the date is here. We, all those boys are turning up. It'll save a lot of dirty rows, boys. No need for this out of trouble, lads. Some of you for this one, you a bad trout. Or hurting on people going to jail, it's not. It's not going to be a nice ending, and we, I don't want it, right? That why everybody knows that. Because I've been trying for peace a long time, right? Now, first of all, I have a list here. Now, I didn't. There's this list now, boys. People is ringing me up, volunteers, and I could fill this trail or this list with another fifty. But I'm just waiting to see what happens, right? This list has been rung up to me, as the boys said this morning. I didn't tell nobody to do anything because it's not up to me to arrange any fights. They're just giving me the list. For some reason, they're giving me the list. And I don't know why they're giving it to me, but they're giving it to me. <laughs> well, anyway, get back to the serious matter, right? Is this, right? I'm going to read out the list, and then I'll carry on what I have to finish now. Now, this is people that rings me today and rang other people, other people come in to me, and I wouldn't put down their names unless this was true. Now, let me take this. Write this down, and this is it, all right? Now, those men, every one of them is turning up 14th. on the 14th of November. We'll be leaving Munningar, Dundalk, and around Ireland, wherever they're coming from England or ever, and we'll be all leaving, and we'll be on the road for half eight. Now, listen to this very carefully, right? My brother James, the legend, right? Versus Birdsmouth, John Paul. Miss. Mrs. John Paul, right? D by. One of the bravest men we ever had, right? Versus 50-50, Paddy Collins. Right? He knows who he is. Martin Anthony versus Old Giggsy. Because he did say that if I had him up to 50 years of age, Martin Anthony is 40-something. Look at when, when our James is 12 years older than Birdsmouth, when he can do it, sure, he should do it, right? Number two. Alice's John from Mullingar versus Huey's Michael. The big fella that's in for Alice's John. 
a big fine man, you should be ashamed. You said you won't go on the tapes because you're saying you're a special or something. Well, I do not. I, I, I seen you the other day. You're not special. When I, when I seen you. Now we'll go to the next one, right? Our James and Huey versus Sunman's John Paul, right? That that'll be a great fight, right? But Huey will knock him out big time. Uh, Sam's John Joe versus Huey's Johnny. Well matched. Right, look at they're all he's, you're all well matched. That's it's fifty fifty that's right. Sam's Christie versus Michael's Martin's Michael. Oh, let's be careful, I'll read them over again in a minute, right? You have myself, the one and only, versus Shaky. And I swear to God in twelve weeks, if you don't hold up Martin, I'm turning up anyway. So I'll be dear Martin, as a matter of fact, I could be the first fight Martin, just to get you get the boys warmed up so you'll be knocked out and you give the boys a great start, right? <laughs> Mary's Jimmy versus Red Jerry. Jerry's Michael. Red Jerry's Michael's in from the whole lot, right? But you know what? Look, by law, 50 50 fights. Yeah. My uncle Tony never had a fight in his life. He's fighting, possibly a legend, year old fella called Giggsy. My uncle comes down with a legend, right? <laughs> we have Martin Anthony. Paddy's Martin Anthony, Anthony with Paddy's Martin Anthony versus Yalas Tony, right? You have Martin Anthony's William versus Red, Jerry's Patrick. You have Mary Shuey and Squeaky. You have Miners Davy versus Missy Stephen. And you have Miners Chrissy versus the one and only Wavy Davy. <laughs> now, you have me already for the Michael James. And Bulls John. John. Bulls John is a big fine boy. Should if he doesn't want to fight, let him make a video and say without going on the Facebook, tell him Michael James doesn't want to fight, tell him the all, get on the Facebook and say or not Facebook that that, um, that joke there, you know, that kind of thing. No, that video and say straight up, look I'm not fighting Michael James and then sure if you have any other one over there mm -hmm. that wants to take his place Michael James didn't accept that. Yeah. Now, any more than that. Now, we get back to that. That's the list now, boys. Look at it. Now, I didn't put down this list. Men is ringing me all day. There's another 20 fellas that are ringing me, and I told them, leave them there for reserves, just in case that yeah. there's other people there that wants to fight them. They're in the reserves, you know what I mean? So, let me, let me go another one now. <coughs> you might say, Paddy's talking shit in that, right? I'm only doing these for the sake of people from getting hurt. And anyway, lads, this is a sport. This is a sport, a sport that can solve people, two and three people baiting a person or yeah. running on one another and breaking up stuff or killing one or whatever, or one another. So this is a sport. Now this is it, right? Now, if it's done right and organised right, we'll have a great day out. Well, we're turning up one way or the other. If he never turned up, we are going to go up that road, we are going to be there in a bus full of us, we get a referee in, we sort out when the time comes, and we'll have a great sport that day, lads, right? It'll be like Dublin playing Loud or Mead right, or right, right. Cork or whatever. It'll be a great day out, boys, right? So that's what I have to say. Now, you, Nellie's Martin, talking about me, about I done this and <coughs> I done that in England or I done that and that. Martin, I could say things about you, Martin, in, in, the, in the prize of Martin, that I wouldn't, I wouldn't repeat, my friend, right? When you used to get drunk, that I saved your bacon loads of times from what you're coming out about Queens and everything else and I wouldn't bother you shaky. But that'll all come to an end when I meet you on the on the fourteen. Now boys, that's all I'm gonna to have to say. It is no need for this trouble or the dirty trouble. Get this on the road. No matter what happens, you can sing all you like, we can die, oh, maybe you might switch one or two if you want. We have no problem with that. But on the fourteenth of November in two thousand and fifteen We'll be on the road a half eight we'll and we'll be rock and rolling and let's go and let's rumble. <laughs> let's, what's that for the Muhammad Ali? Call it rumbling.